Hey guys, today we are going to talk about the great Mr. Stoneface, Buster Keaton. Buster was a silent actor in the 1920s and he made comical but insanely dangerous films. There are many parkour athletes today that actually follow the trail of Keaton, like Pasha the Boss or Alex Shower. Now that begs the question, was Buster the first to do parkour on camera? My name is Corbin Reinhardt and I've been doing parkour for over 10 years now. I'm on Team Tempest in LA. Now I'm gonna mainly focus on the earlier films from the 1920s to the 1930s because that's when I think Buster was at his peak. What? Oh my God. That's not real, is it? Holy crap. That was insane. <laughs> what? How do they make that happen? Oh my lord. That's like a jet plane engine. He was the first person to ever do that stunt of having his hand get pulled from the car and then he gets it too. There are a couple of athletes that have done that nowadays, but I've heard it's a lot harder than it looks. <laughs> oh, what? So many people now use those sand hills as their foam pit nowadays. The fact that he was doing that back in the 1920s is pretty incredible. Here is the first shirt that I've ever made and they are going away very soon. So if you want to help support this channel, please grab one at the link above. Whoa! That person wasn't real, that was a doll, right? Oh! How did he do that? Ho oh, ho 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 ho! That must have been the first time it was ever done. That is one of the most classic stunts of all time. There's gotta be hundreds of movies that have done that. And it's all owed to Buster Keaton. Could that have been the first ascent ever? Literally uses the arm to get into the car? What? By today's standards, that's insane. Was he actually in there with lions? What? Did he just do the first thread dive roll? I can't believe he just did that. That's insane. That's awesome. So the question is, was Buster Keaton the first to really be doing parkour on camera? The answer to that is tough. These were incredible, incredible stunts. And he did a lot of parkour type movements, but it wasn't really from point A to point B. He wasn't trying to get over obstacles as efficiently as possible. They weren't like Jackie Chan stunts where he would get from the top of the building down to the floor in like five seconds. So I think he inspired a lot of what parkour is nowadays, but I do not think he's the founder of it. Please comment down below what you think I should react to next. Also hit that like button and hit the join if you want to be part of the Heart Club. Later skaters.